The annual Pens and Pins event was held last week to benefit Make-A-Wish. Penguin players served as team captains for teams of Make-A-Wish kids. The event was sponsored by the Penguins Wives Association and organized by Veronica Fleury. We have all the Penguins players and the coaches here playing with Wish Kids and uh, we have great, great, great fans that are coming and uh, just coming to help make wishes come true. The players were happy to make the Wish Kids smile, even if their bowling games were not on par with their on-ice skills. It's good to give back and uh, also the parents that are here. I'm, I'm a parent myself. Uh, to see your own kids smile and having fun and uh, the, the, the way they act, the way they interact with, uh, with the players. Uh, I'd like my kids to have a big smile on their face like, uh, like they do here today. Um, I'm real thankful to be here, to meet everybody. My game's not great. Hopefully I can help my team a little more, but uh, I think some of the kids are all bowling me, so I have some work to do. Uh, I'm bowling with Malkin. He's fun, but he's not very good at bowling. No, no, I think I'm best. New head coach Mike Johnston was thrilled that his players could aid in such a good cause. You can see with our players, they're almost like kids here as well. These types of events, they love it because it's, it's relaxing, it's informal, and they get to do an activity and, and we'll hopefully pick up the spirits of some of these kids. And, and it's been great. It's been a lot of fun so far. The lanes were full here at the 6th Annual Pens and Pins event. You can tell by the smiles that the kids were having a lot of fun, and so were the players. At Neville Island Bowling, I'm Daisy Ruth, Duke TV News 14.